excuse how I look. Um, I literally just worked out and I'm all sweaty, but I just got the package now. I'm super excited to open this, so let's get into it. Hi guys, what's up? It's Natalie. Welcome to our welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in today's video, I'm so excited. I've had this video planned for about two months now. Um, I ordered a wig from ZL. Zell? ZL. The name's gonna be right here. I'm very disappointed. I'm just gonna start off by saying I'm so disappointed about the customer service. I've waited four months for this wig. Getting in touch with them was literally like getting in touch with the president. Um, it was very hard to get updates on my wig and when it was gonna be here. So hopefully this is a really good wig. I tried emailing them on updates and then I got ignored after like three emails. They just stopped answering me so then I went on to their Instagram I got a couple DMs from them saying that they're gonna check the status and then they ghosted me so then I went on their Instagram and then stood and then started commenting like please answer me like the customer service is horrible and finally someone did and they actually sped up the shipping process I don't know it kept pushing back on the dates of when this wig was going to get here it first said it was gonna get here in September then October then it said November and I understand these are like custom made wigs like handcrafted and stuff but I don't know I just feel like it was not good for them to ignore me um so anyways let's get into the video so this wig is called said nudes i'm gonna insert a picture right here the box feels really really light this is supposed to be 22 inches okay so the packaging looks very like cheap i spent like 600 dollars on this wig so this is the wig and then it also comes with Let's see, um, this is a four step process for hair extensions. I didn't order hair extensions though, so um, I think this is just like a care, how to like take care of them, I guess, I don't know, that's weird. And then they also came with these moisture lock bags, instant moisture microwavable bags. Wait, what? That's very, different I've never had those before okay so now this is the wig this is like a Shein type like ziploc I would say wait what wait what this does not feel like human hair okay wait first opinion this does not look like what I ordered like at all it feels like almost like a costume wig and this is definitely not 20 two inches long this is maybe like 18 18 inches long i'm so confused okay so this is like the inside it has the clips um and then it has the band and then you can also like adjust it right there like the bra strap i'm very 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 <laughs> worried about this let me go try this on and i will be right back okay this is what the wig looks like um it sheds like this is literally all that came out of my head the head like the wig that's a lot of hair i will say it's very soft like extremely soft but like the shedding is really annoying and it just feels very cheap they didn't give any wig caps, so that's really annoying for the price I paid for this. They should like at least give you wig cap. It's comfortable. It looks very bulky right up here. Um, and I'm not sure if it's the way I braided my hair or like the way that the wig just is. Um, this is what the back looks like. I do not think this is 22 inches at all. Um, I've had hair extensions that are 22 inches and this just like is maybe 18, which is <laughs> annoying. Um, would I buy from them again? No, I would not because this is like really, it feels like a costume wig and it's supposed to be human hair. So also if I'm looking right here, it's because um, I'm looking at myself. 
but yeah this is supposed to be human hair and it just doesn't feel good and for six hundred dollars i would think that this company would be like a luxury wig company and it's this does not feel luxury to me i will say that the hairline is pretty good i don't know if you guys can like see that um that's good so that's one good thing the color is pretty it just does not look like what i like bought does that make sense like i looked on tiktok and i'll even insert their tiktok right here straight out of the box that is not the same wig as this wig this girl had it like pinned up like that looks kind of cute but i don't know it's just it's not it i'm gonna have to like style it and kind of figure out how i can use this because right now i like literally hate this wig and i don't know if it's just because of the way it's styled or the, the fact that i'm not wearing a wig cap underneath let me straighten it and then i'll come back dimension in it I like how it's like dark right here and then it goes like really light um I did notice though it's very like bandy like does that make sense like I don't know if I'm just being like a little bit too nitpicky but I feel like for the price I should be like that I'm gonna finish this side and then I'm gonna give like my overall general idea on this wig this is it straightened very very soft very very smooth the highlights are pretty good in it i don't know if i got everything in the back but that's what the back looks like um overall would i buy from this company again no like i said i just wouldn't um just with the customer service alone i don't feel comfortable i almost recorded this company to my credit card because I was like I still don't have the wig like I'm getting nervous so now the wig is okay made I did lose like a lot of hair like I said um and it wasn't from like me topping the wig or anything I didn't even cut the wig but I think this is like a good a good wig if you are paying maybe like $300 to $200 is it worth six hundred dollars no no and i also got this wig on sale too so that's kind of disappointing the four month wait was really disappointing the customer service was 
really disappointing. The not getting a wig cap was very disappointing. It is what it is. Definitely save your money. I would save your money. I would not get this wig. Um, it looks cute. It's okay. I just don't think it's worth the price. Let me know what you guys think. Do you guys like the wig? Do you guys hate it? Do you guys think it looks chewy? Let me know. <laughs> Anyways guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Really fast, I did end the video, but I'm looking back at this wig, and I'm noticing how much blonder it is in the photo than it is like in real life. Yeah, it's a lot blonder in the photo, and it also says that it's 22 inches. This is not 22 Ooh. inches at all. I am kind of confused like did I buy did I get the wrong wig did I I don't know but yeah I'm looking at it right now and I just wanted to make sure I wasn't like wrong from what like I remember but yeah I just wanted to throw that in here I also wanted to add that I did spend my own money on this wig it's not like I was gifted this wig it wasn't like I got like a discount on this wig or it's not like how they asked me to do this video this is all my opinion this is basically a review on my wig that I purchased myself. Anyways, okay, I'm back again. Sorry, I keep forgetting to say stuff. I'm going to link the wig, this wig, um, in the down box below if you guys do want it. Um, just know that it's going to take a while for it to ship and for you guys to get it. So if you're thinking about getting it for like Christmas or something, maybe order now. You probably should have ordered like a month ago um to even get this on christmas but i'm looking at the return policy nothing is returnable you can't return any of the wigs um and it says that it will be on time dispatched 10 days and ships within one to five days that is not true at all um but yeah look at their website i guess Spend your money wisely. Um, yeah, that's all I really have to say about that.